What is up guys, Mr. The Reverts here and I just wanted to post this quick little video going over a few things that we found out today regarding Call of Duty Modern Warfare multiplayer because currently a bunch of YouTubers and just media personnel all over the community are currently at the reveal event. Plus they've already played the game which is pretty crazy to think about. But with that some of them have posted images of the reveal showing the pre-game lobby layout and it just looks like a traditional Modern Warfare style style lobby kind of nostalgic but also very modern at the same time with the animated backgrounds of the character or operator you're playing with now you may also notice in some of the lobbies there is a player count of above 10 total players or above 12 total players which is unusual because we've had a maximum of 12 player uh, lobbies for most of the game modes in the call of duty universe um, but this might be because they're playing in a private match which typically does hold more players than regular pub games or they could also be playing on a different game mode that requires more more than um, the traditional 10 or 12 players I don't know but yeah that's basically the lobby layout pretty simple but still it looks really really awesome next up I want to talk about the field equipment so at the reveal event the players were handed these little cards that let players know what button does what on the controller it's kind of like an information card and if you press L1 and R1 on the controller then that's going to activate your field equipment so I assume this is what's going to take place of the specialist weapons in the game except you have the option to select a piece of equipment such as say a smoke grenade or maybe a trophy system for example. That's just my theory but please tell me yours down below in the comments. Um, for sure I can see this activating over time as you progress in game again just like specialist weapons. Uh, I definitely do hope there isn't anything that could be just extremely overpowered that basically just guarantees you a kill like the gravity spikes or an attack dog. Um, I'm totally okay if they just stick to tactical equipment gear. That's completely fine by me, but anything that just will guarantee the enemy player a kill for just staying in the lobby is ridiculous to me. I hope that does not come in this game. So yeah, that's what field equipment basically is, I think in my opinion. And the next up here, not like this was a huge surprise, but there more than likely is going to be a Modern Warfare beta because on the CallofDuty.com slash beta website, it would redirect you to a link called profile.callofduty.com slash modern warfare slash beta. But whenever you go to the site now, you get an error because that website was not officially up and running yet. And as of now, as I'm recording this video even, it's going to direct you to the blackout beta link. Um, but like I said before that, you could go onto a modern warfare beta page. So more than likely, we are going to be getting a beta and that announcement should be revealed to us at the Modern Warfare multiplayer reveal event on Thursday. We also found out that the Call of Duty Modern Warfare Dark Edition will be coming with night vision goggles, very, very similar to the Modern Warfare 2 ones, um, which look freaking sick. And the price for these haven't been revealed to us yet, but my guess it's going to be somewhere between $200 to $400. And then finally, I do have some gameplay of Modern Warfare multiplayer to show y'all, and this is coming over on the modern warfare subreddit but the footage is from somebody who was at the reveal event and he's basically just recording the people around him playing the game and yeah i really wanted to throw that in there for you guys you can find the link down below in the description because i don't want to spoil it for those of you who'd rather see first look at the footage on thursday nor will i talk about some of the things in the footage but i will say that the traditional hud display is just very very different in fact a lot of things about this game are very different compared to the previous Call the games that we are used to playing um, even just by looking at the controller scheme uh, screenshot I put on screen for you guys earlier in the video will get you like a, a quick little rundown of how different this game really is so um, you can find the link down below if you guys want to see actual gameplay. I'm not going to talk about it, but it's there for you guys if you want to see it. So with that, guys, please let me know your thoughts about everything down below in the comments. There is so, so much hype for this Call of Duty game. It's crazy. I've also talked to some people who were at the reveal event, and based off their tweets I've been seeing too and, and just from talking to them, there truly is a lot of love for this game. It's crazy. Only two more days till the multiplayer reveal, guys. I'm so, so excited. Don't forget to leave a like on the video if you guys did enjoy and subscribe for more Call of Duty Modern Warfare news, rumors, and information. Thanks so much for watching. Love you all so much. Till next time, I'll see you later.